Am I the chat so fucked up? Anyway, why hello there, welcome back to Caradel. Today we're going to continue to build our one million stack. As well as raise aware aw awareness awareness about the situation in Ethiopia right now. There's a terrible drought going on. It's considered a category one disaster. That means that it's in line with the tsunami that hit India and Indonesia a couple years back. And uh, well, there's 400,000 children in acute, in a state of acute malnourishment, and they need our help to get the word out. Uh, and to donate using the gaming for good link down below if you want to go check that out that's great and if you uh, if you were to talk about that with all of your friends and family that would be amazing anyway let's get right back into this game last time you we were just uh, you know casually uh, beating up Russia and then all of a sudden the Commonwealth attacked Together with their coalition buddies this time. This is the third time the Commonwealth has declared war on me. And every single time, I've taken a 100% war score off of them. So, maybe this time they'll learn their lesson. I don't think so, but we'll have to see. Flory, did you watch Shen play Byzantium? Um. Yeah, a little bit. A tinsy wincy bit. I wasn't watching all the time though, because I had to... Uh... No, I, I, I went to work and all that. I'm pretty sure I haven't raised any of these provinces. See, that's better. This feels really loud. It feels really loud on my ears. It shouldn't be that much of a problem for you. It means I can't make any hungry African jokes. Well, I mean, uh, I mean, what you can do and what you can't do. I mean, that's just kind of, you know, not really my territory, you know, is it? Of course, it will be in a little bit of bad taste, you know. I mean. Raise the Tommy here. No, oh, whatever. A lot of the provinces are going to want to rise up. Let's see what exactly our overextension is here, though. It's 84%, that's more like it. Now, all of these provinces had uh, increased scoring costs, so it's only natural that we don't really have the admin to, uh, to core all that. Right, let's go uh, fight the Commonwealth. Too bad I don't have my uh, one million stack right about now. How is work? Exhausting. Especially with only four hours of sleep I had last night. That was uh, not exactly uh, you know, easy. And I gotta work tomorrow as well, so... I don't know how long I'll stream today. I'll try and do the same thing that we did yesterday. It's gonna be... Pretty fucking hard, though. You know, those Ethiopians need our help a lot more than I need sleep, so fuck that shit, we keep going. Just let it fly off. <laughs> uh, 
Oh boy, my uh, tribes need more. Uh... Need more land. Oh wow, they need a lot more land. Jesus. That's 6.6k without any policies. Yeah, I'm really feeling like if I integrate, um, actually I should be able to get it done. And we're just gonna siege up the Commonwealth here and uh, see what we can do. Also, these ships really need to block off them. Um, Malaysia. You disappoint, Jake. What? How? When? What happens? Hmm. I wouldn't want to disappoint Jake Senpai. Senpai, please. Although I do. Readily admit that I disappoint Jake Senpai on a <coughs> daily basis. <laughs> Take uh, plenty of loans for it, too. So. Could tech up military, but we're not in the business of teching up military. We're in the business of not teching up military, so let's continue to not do anything about our military tech right now. Why not focus on uh, Malacca first while Austria keeps the Commonwealth uh, occupied? Because Malika is going to run around in circles for many, 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 many years until they reach my capital, and then they're going to siege that down. So, not really worried about them. Hassa isn't going to do anything. I just need to siege down the Commonwealth, and then hit a 50% war score, and then eventually we'll be able to piece this guy out. This ridiculous war of his, it's fucking stupid. And maybe you uh, get a province or two. Well, hopefully. I have to see how well this is gonna go, but... No. This is gonna be the last war I fight without my 1 million stack, though, I can tell you that much. Well, most likely. Also, paying back the final loan. Thank God. Also, finally making some decent money now. Fucking hell, that took me long enough. Okay, so he's got a stack right there for 30k men. He's going to move into marches and then he's probably going to go to Kiev. So I kind of want to say hi to him there. Yeah, he's going to Kiev. Right, he changed his mind. I kind of want to be in the good general business. That's more like it. And we'll try to win that battle. Not a joke, do I believe in ghosts and sp <sighs> He's allied with Scandinavia? Really?
Man, that is lame. Uh, no, no, I don't believe in ghosts and spirits. Man, that is lame, though. Fuck, dude. Balls are you sinking about, you bastard. Yeah, I need to get this war with e uh, Commonwealth done as fast as possible. I'm just gonna wipe peace as soon as I can. Thankfully, it's to show superiority war, and all of my troops are on this side, plus. Austria and uh, Austria's losing to um, to the Pope, which is to be expected. I mean, the Pope is uh, really strong in this game, apparently. No! Why would you do this? Well, I can kiss those cannons goodbye. Jesus. Ah! Alright, we're gonna have to, um... We're gonna have to get a little support group on the go here. I need me a little support group. The thing is, I'm going to lose a lot of men if I build this right now. Like, I'm going to lose a lot of men if I were to build that right now. Do I build it now or do I build it later? I need to build it in two steps anyway. Right, hold on. Let's wait until this army gets squished. Okay, that's gonna make the building of this army a little cheaper. Also, if I build it now... I'm just afraid I'm gonna lose so many men. Because it's going to queue them up everywhere. And uh, event like a whole bunch of them are going to march into the enemy. So maybe now is not the time. But the Ottomans marching into my land is so stupid. Ugh.
It's just so lame. Like, shouldn't you have anything better to do? Because now he's gonna help out the fucking Commonwealth. I mean, the Commonwealth is gonna help him. Oh, it looks like I got really lucky there. I really do need some kind of reinforcements though, so maybe we just should just build like some extra horses and some extra cannon. See, that, that already gets really expensive, but yeah, we do need these troops. To even uh, stand a chance of beating this now. The fucking Scandinavians in the war. Really? Scandinavia and those other bastards? That's a little much. You know, that's just kind of what AI does nowadays. Build them individually, one province at a time, that won't take long at all. Yeah. I mean, that's just 500 clicks. Oh! Bullshit! See how long that took? That took fucking ages, man. Oh, the common one. The fucking. Ottomans declaring war there. And now I lost a whole bunch of men, so I only have 50k. Oh, I'm gonna lose a whole bunch of men still. Because they're all gonna. See, this is why I didn't want to build the 500 stack, because then we'd get this crap all the way. F like, it would start happening over here, and then it would. Yeah. This is terrible. This is fucking shit. I should have won that battle there. Should have won the battle before that, too. Uh. But you know, they held on in the annoying way that the AI sometimes does. My armies are made of paper. Well... No, they're made of horses and uh, blood. But... You know, if I have a whole bunch of these 1000 stacks that uh, kind of just walk in whatever way that they, you know, want to walk in, then... They're gonna run into a lot of enemies, and those enemies are naturally gonna be ten times the size that they are, so... Yeah, teching up is uh, for the week, so uh, I'm, I'm gonna continue not teching up. <laughs> no, we'll pull through. You got full confidence in our abilities that we'll uh, pull through. stand by the point that the fucking autos declaring is gonna like I was gonna wreck the shit out of this war man and then the Ottomans declare that is so unfortunate and it happens all the time in especially in the late game if you get declared upon by someone then uh, nine out of ten times you get declared upon by four other people 
is just kind of how it goes because they'll add those troops to their troops and and then they're gonna be like, oh yeah, we can totally win this war now. Because uh, obviously he's at war with these people, so. Like, uh, the fact he can peace out, like, within two years into the war and we'll get wrecked and lose all of our shit, that's a uh, side issue. Oh well. Close to 2.5k followers! Yeah, I knew! It was really funny. Fucking, uh. <laughs> I was watching Shen, I just said hi, and he was like, Oh, hey, guys, if you haven't checked out Floriori, go check him out. And then I looked at my phone, and my phone just fucking exploded. I got, instantly got like 10 follows. <laughs> really good shit. Shen's such a fucking nice guy. Holy shit. Alright. Is it like World War I? It is fucking stupid. Like, the late game always turns into this. Like, they won't consider other things for like a moment. It's just gonna be like, oh. He's at war with this guy? He's now at war with me. Have fun, bro. <sighs> if I can't kick out the co I can't fucking hope to kick out the Commonwealth anytime soon. I feel like I just need to like take care of uh, the autos first because this guy's gonna have this stupid fucking uh, you know that modifier plus 30 colonial war coalition war there's no way I can piece him out unless I can make that modifier go away which I can't until I siege down their capital and I can't exactly do that If uh, the autos keep interfering, so. Well, no, well, I was, I was kicking him in the balls before, really hard, but, uh, you know, shit kinda happened. The, uh, like if it's just the Commonwealth alone, it's really easy to... Other people get involved and everything just goes to shit. It does kind of make Imperial Russia look like a pussy now, doesn't it? Alright. Let's hope he doesn't succeed here. He's probably gonna succeed though, who am I kidding? Oh, well, what do you know, I got real lucky there. Okay, let's wait until the 22nd. Cancel this. 28th. So, 27th, really. Cancel that. I was just about ready to make, start making like tons of money. You know, it was all gonna be so beautiful. Fucking shitty, fucking aggressive AI late game is just so not fun to deal with. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's never just the Commonwealth. Oh my. God, yeah, you know what? Fuck this bullshit. Oh my goodness. I yeah, may as well retreat. Oh man. 
so much hate right now. It won't work right now. The stacks are too big. Well, it, I mean, it'll work a lot of times, but it'll also fail a lot of times. That's <sighs> 7.3k. With the uh, actually integrated, that should be very close to 10. really want to make it now, but I kind of can't. Like maybe I can build it down here. I mean, I can't now. I'm, I'm already fucking reinforcing all this crap, so... It's not gonna work now. Ah, whatever, let's just try it. Should be funny anyway. I should totally try it now. Go grab some easy, e e easy Persian clay? No, no, no. It's not how we roll here in this stream. I'm not about to just give them some land. I haven't lost a single war, and I intend to keep it that way. With that, checking out my military. Should we do it now? these to die so we'll build 200 and then see what happens like see how far out of India they put they put these use voodoo magic no 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 voodoo magic for me today I say that's pretty safe we'll add another 200 Empire right now, so I had a hundred mercenaries to that as well. Oh man, this is gonna be so sick. <laughs> now remember, we can only squish stacks with uh, 50 or less right now. With this. But doesn't change the fact that we can squish 50 stacks. And if they move into my territory, they will split those up, so... You should commit seppuku. Yeah, the game doesn't like uh, 1 million stacks, not in the slightest. Although after they're finished, the game's pretty alright with it. 
I mean, after it's finished, it, it, it's just a normal thing. Do we need policies for attrition? We already got those. We're at, um... Hold on, I can show you this uh, nice country modifier here. We've got a national attrition modifier of negative 105%. So, technically we shouldn't suffer attrition, 